just 17 seconds of pure thought is worth 2,000 man hours of work. 17 seconds is the ignition point of all manifestations. 17 seconds of focus is all you need. channel. I'm Lira Alexandra. If you're new, please join the baby elephant community by subscribing today. Subscribe below right now. Today we're finally going to talk about the amazing 17 second rule of manifestation by Abraham Hicks. I'm going to give you a super simple approach to implementing this tool into your law of attraction practice. Before we jump into the video though, my friend Shabby K is going to give you guys a little law of attraction story to get your vibrations way, way, way up right in the start of the video. Hey everyone, I'm Shabby. Thank you so much Lira for having me here. I'm so excited to share my manifestation and law of attraction story with you um shout out to all the baby elephants you guys are the real mvps leor and i got into this conversation after i tweeted her back seeing her tweet about not only manifesting one but two dimples and i responded because these little things are what makes non-believers believers one crazy thing that happened to me was i'm gonna grab you what i used the secret there was a page about money and it pretty much said just go pick up any bill or check you have around the house and treat it as if you just received it as a check in the mail. Anything with a dollar sign in front of it, I picked it up and I kid you not, I had a stack like this big. I went through every single one of them and I was like, oh, I just got this much in my bank account. Oh, okay, I got this one. Ka -ching, I'm rich. And I did it when I was alone, distant from everything, just me being one with the universe and all these checks in the mail. I received a four-figure check in the mail that week. I had no idea I was even gonna receive. If you just do it within yourself and believe, you will achieve. Thank you, Shabby. You guys, make sure to check out her YouTube channel. The link will be in the description below. So according to Abraham Hicks, 17 seconds is the combustion, the ignition point of all manifestation. If you hold a thought, Without distraction for 17 seconds, you set in motion that manifestation. The purpose of this method is to get you thinking purely for 17 seconds to have that manifestation and that desire become stronger and stronger until you reach 68 seconds. Each fourth of that 68 seconds gets stronger than the last, thereby creating a truly powerful manifestation and a point of attraction. For this technique, I first want to remind you guys a few very important points about the law of attraction. First is that you get what you think about whether you want it or not not. What we think is what we become, what our lives become, what our experience becomes, what our reality becomes. Number two is that your point of attraction is where you are right now at this moment wherever you are watching or listening to this video. Whatever you are thinking now is setting in motion of manifestations and attractions for your future. You're determining your future from this moment on. This is your point of attraction. Third is that your thoughts and emotions are vibrational and your vibrations are answered by the universe through the law of attraction. And the fourth is that as your vibration vibration expands and becomes more powerful, it becomes strong enough for a manifestation to occur. So this explains why holding a thought for 17 seconds and then another 17, another 17, and another 17 will create a perfect alignment for attraction to take place. The reason why I think that this method is so powerful is because it gives you a specific amount of time to focus on your desire. If you're able to do this even once a day for 68 seconds, then go about your day and let go of that, that attachment to that desire, then you are in perfect alignment. So many of you ask me, how do you let go while still visualizing? Which is a perfectly, that's a great question. How do you let go of something that you're imagining and envisioning all the time? You're not letting go of that desire. You're letting go of the attachment to the outcome of that desire. You know, you know perfectly well that it's going to come to you one way or the other and you let go of the attachment to the end result. Letting go of that attachment gets rid of the desperate vibes because when you give out a desperate vibration, you are actually focusing on the lack of having what you desire. So this method is perfect for people who have a hard time letting go of their desires. So let's go through the 17 second rules in a simple step by step. You can do this in your head or out loud or with another person or even write it down. The absolute key to this, however, is for that 17 seconds and then the remaining 51 seconds that you do not contradict 
your desire or your thoughts. That means if you're asking for a certain thing, if you're focusing on money, you don't think to yourself, but no, I don't have money or it might be hard to get money. You have to have pure thoughts, pure desire. So first you're going to set a timer for 17 seconds. Before starting this timer, you have to get into a great headspace, a great vibration by recalling a happy feeling or a good memory. I personally like to use the feeling of relief for this method. I tell myself that I'm on the right path, I'm here because I'm meant to be here, what I'm doing matters, my work, my life matters. I make myself feel relief and for me, relief is a very high vibrational uh, emotion. I tell myself that the universe has conspired to put me exactly where I am right now and that everything's okay in the end. If it's not okay, it's not the end. Put yourself into a really happy state. Think of a happy memory. Think of somebody or someone or a time that made you really happy. Get into that headspace. Once you feel really, really good, start the timer and start to focus on that one thing that you really, really want and have perfect, pure desire. Do not contradict yourself for 17 seconds. So you're now feeling good, you're thinking about what it is that you desire, so it should be making you th think even better, and you're not allowing yourself to ruin your own manifestations by doubting yourself. When your timer goes off, you're now going to set it for an additional 51 seconds. You're going to go back to that initial desire that you were thinking about for the past 17 seconds, still feeling great, and you're going to think about it in more detail and allow that thought to become more powerful and stronger for the rest of those 51 seconds. Once your timer goes off, that's it. You've officially set in motion that manifestation and it is on its way to you. You must now thank the universe for bringing it to you and let it go. Go on with your day. Go take care of yourself. Go take care of business. Keep yourself busy. It's coming to you now. You've created a super powerful manifestation that is on its way to you and that will come to you as long as you're focusing on other things. If you contradicted the thought within that 68 seconds or started thinking about something that you don't want, don't worry. You have the ability to place your attention wherever it is that you want. So you are able to take, to distract yourself from the unwanted thing and put your attention back onto the wanted thing. So just start over. Just keep going back to that desired thought until it becomes second nature to be thinking the way that you want your life to play out. It's not too difficult to change your pattern of vibration, especially when you understand that you can do it a little bit at a time. Once you have an understanding of how vibration works, how it affects your experience, and most importantly what your emotions are telling you about your vibration, you can now make steady, fast progress toward achieving anything that you desire. Okay, so that's it for today's video, my loves. Start practicing this technique right this second. Remember your point of attraction is right now. Also, if you haven't seen yesterday's video yet, it was a little clip from the live stream that I had with my Patreon supporters last Saturday, Saturday, September 23rd. If you want to become a part of these monthly to bi-monthly live stream, private live stream hangouts where we talk one-on-one -on -one for hours, and if you want access to ex exclusive content such as podcasts, all you have to do is become a Patreon supporter for as little as $5 a month. The link will be in the description and I really, really appreciate it you guys. If you haven't yet seen it, last week's live stream was about karma, about past life regression, and finding our purpose in the universe. Make sure you check out that video. I'll link that below as well. Other than that, until my next video, keep your vibrations way, way, way up. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for being here. Bye. <laughs>